Hello friends today's vlog will be again something that soothes the summer interestingly and also effectively we will show you how to cool your system by doing the simple and natural ice pops or ice lollies by using fruit juices these ice pops were enjoyed very much by the 90s people so without any further ado let's move on so today we are about to do grape ice pop and strawberry ice pop the ingredients needed are sugar or any other sweetening agents like honey etc so let's start with the grape one start to remove the grapes from its stem and place them in a bowl tada all ready next is with the strawberry too An easy way to remove the leaves from the strawberry is to take a hard straw from any zipper or bottle and all you need to do is insert the straw at the bottom and push the straw upwards and voila pretty easy right So it's time to do our grape ice pop and all the grapes into the blender and put your amount of required sugar but i am not adding more than a spoon and start to blend it until you get the juicy consistency of the grape now filter the juice by parting the seed and other unwanted skins using the strainer Drain every part of the juice, and we are done. You will get this type of mold easily at any shops nearby, but see to that you get a quality one. So pour the grape juice into each mold considerably, and close them using its notch. You're all done. So let's hop on into a strawberry ice pop. Add all the strawberries into the blender and start to blend them. Add a spoon of honey if needed. It's not compulsory as strawberry has already lots of sweetening flavor. You can even add sugar for sweetening. Now pour the strawberry juice into the mold and close the lid properly. So, time to freeze them. Ice pops need to be freezed for minimum 4 to 5 hours until frozen. Oh my god. can't wait to see them but be careful with the next step hold your mold under warm water for a minute so that the ends get easily loosened and the pops won't break in half oh my god look at them they taste so sweetful and fruitful I am loving it. Please do try these ice pops in your home. So that's it for today, lasses. Let's hop on to the tip. Tips for removing ice pops from their molds. Sometimes ice pops just won't come out of the molds or they break in half when you're taking them out, which makes your popsicle experience far less fun than it normally is. So one Hold your mold under warm running water for a minute. Be sure to let the warm water hit the top and bottom of the mold, not just the middle. Your goal is to loosen the ends, not the middle of the pop. Two. Be sure your ice pops have the right amount of sweetener versus liquid. When adding fruit to ice pops, chop the pieces into small, not huge chunks. Larger food chunks get in the way of the liquid for freezing, which can result in breakage. Hope this tip would help you out to have a lovely ice pop. 
If you do enjoyed watching these ice pops, don't forget to pop your love by subscribing to our channel, by clicking the like button, by sharing with your friends, and by commenting your thoughts. Also, don't forget to click the bell icon to never miss any of our new updates. Love you, lasses. Until that, peace, assy, and stay classy. Bye.